Okay, so here's what we're going to do, folks. We are going to take these soap bubbles and fill them up with methane, which is also known as natural gas. Cows belch it as part of their digestive process. We flatulate it as part of our digestive process. Actually, the majority of flatulence is air, but there is a great deal of methane in it, which makes your flatulence... You know what that is, right? Farts. Good deal. Can you really lay it on fire? Oh, yes. They are indeed flammable. Actually, Adam on the Mythbusters demonstrated this process through a pair of blue jeans, and he kind of scorched himself. Yeah. But what we're going to do is we're going to pump pure methane through soap bubbles. And we're going to collect those soap bubbles in this bowl right here. Now, the reason I have a little loop in here is just like the trap in your sink or in your toilet. It prevents the soap bubbles from getting into here, and it just kind of makes everything work out just beautifully. So let's try this. What I'm going to do is turn the gas on. Yes? Tell me when to start recording. <clears throat> Anytime you want. When is it going to start exploding? Oh, you're only interested in the explosion. You don't care about the explanation. Yeah. <laughs> Kids. All right. I'm going to turn the gas on to the room. Am I going to die? There we go. Now, this is methane natural gas, and what we're going to do is we're going to pump it through these soap bubbles, collect them in here, and then ignite them so you can see just how much energy is stored in natural gas. Let's start this process, shall we? Oh dear. Hmm. They turned the gas on. No. No. Yes. Aha! Okay. All right, let's try that again, shall we? See? Now it's on. Here we go. Collecting bubbles in the bowl. I want them not broken, but totally whole. If the gas escapes into the room, we will certainly meet our doom. Because when I light the lighter on fire, it will make you all perspire. But I hope you don't get tired of the flame that will emit from the bowl. I think I want to put more, the flame you can't ignore. It's really quite a chore, but it certainly won't be a bore. Here is a bowl of bubbles. Can I get the light off, please? Oh yes, you definitely want the light off for this. And three, two, one. Again, again, All right, let's do it again. Um, more so. I know. Yes, the flame they do adore. So I'll do it once more. Let's see if we got here. There we go. Bubbles, so innocuous, nobody pays them any mind. They see bubbles, they're like, ooh, isn't that neat? It's bubbles. But nobody knows that these bubbles could have flamey stuff within them. Oh, yes. Now, methane is a very simple molecule. It's made of carbon bonded to four hydrogens. It's the simplest organic molecule you can find, but it's packed full of energy. In fact, most hydrocarbons like methane are. Propane, which you use for your gas grill, it's also a hydrocarbon, as is butane, which is what's in this lighter that allows us to light it on fire to begin with, and octane, which we use for gasoline. But methane gives us a very satisfactory display. I hope I don't burn down the house. <laughs> Pretty cool, huh? Now, I've seen videos where people can actually put the bubbles in their hair and light them on fire. <laughs> but I'm not going to do that. Mr. Rosen. What? Yeah, I got you. Are you going to do it again? Let me see that. Oh, goodness. <laughs> you have got to send that to me. That's going to become my new Facebook photo. It's epic. <laughs> Oh, you totally have to send that to me. Put him in the bag. So. <laughs> <laughs> That's all. Yeah, exactly. 
that's what I. Okay. <laughs> you can send that one to me too. <laughs> oh, that's great. I got this one and then I got that one too. It looks like you're eating the fire here. One more time? Yeah. Yes. All right, one more time. I'm actually really enjoying this, to be honest. I'll take more pictures. I got a good view. Okay. The flames they love to see. So we're gonna go for three. Here we go. And they always ask me when the fire alarm goes off it was my fault. Never is. Maybe I should just make it go off. No, I can't do that. I don't have to go to Spanish. No. <laughs> Let's see. Giant, flamey, or Spanish? I you want more bubbles? Yeah. yeah. Don't hit the ceiling, though. Make more Don't bubbles. Don't hit the ceiling with the fire. Oh, no. It's been hitting the ceiling every time. Well, we don't need to burn the ceiling. Oh, no. We're not going to burn the ceiling. You see, it's totally and completely harmless. You ready? Yes. Fire! Diverge. Did you see? It hits the ceiling and spread out. The reason the ceiling didn't catch fire is because it's what's called a flash. It happens so quickly that the ceiling tiles don't have time to heat up to the point where they combust, and so they don't burn. Now, if, if I took this and held it to the ceiling, eventually it may catch fire. But this is such a quick process that it doesn't have time to heat it up. The ceiling will actually remain fairly cool.